Hi, I'm in Home Assistant. It's Sunday, Smart Home Dinkery time. And all I'm really working on at the moment, and I just thought I'd give you a quick update, jumping straight to it. I'm trying to create a nice card in the Lovelace dashboard in Home Assistant that shows the Ruby tag, which is a multi-sensor tag. I want it to be shown in all its glory. And I'm playing with some different cards here. There's, you know, the temperature is the most important. But look, to be honest, this is the most interesting card I've got at the moment that I'm happy with. So it's a single card and humidity, air pressure, movement, temperature, and you can even see the temperature graph there. Uh, this is quite nice. I have to say, I like this, but I will keep playing around. I like these little chips, part of the mushroom card style. That's kind of nice. But what I would like is, I would like maybe this kind of card, but with these chips inside. Ooh, that would be fancy. I think I'm going to have to go custom. This card's actually really, really easy. Let me just open it up here. Edit. This one is just a basic uh, entities card. And then just add the entities in. And there you go. Now, what I didn't realize, which is pretty cool, is so let's uh, take away one. And then a footer, you can actually add in a graph and then I just need to pick the graph that I want to add. So let's say temperature. Ooh, there it is. Of course, I might want to actually put two. So this is this is uh, this is quite nice. This is interesting. But favorite one at the moment? Yeah, this one. All right, I will dig in to creating an absolute custom card. Let's see if I can do that next week. So I'll see if I can create something like this, but with the other details somehow embedded into the same card. If I can't do that, I'll just live with this one on the right. This is nice. <laughs> see you next week. Oh, any tips? Let me know down below. Bye.